Hello everyone, Gabriel Gelina here for the Car Guide. Welcome to Athens in Greece for this first drive of the 2022 Audi RS3. Now this is the third generation model for the RS3. It still has that fabulous five-cylinder engine. It's got an all-new interior and it also has new drive modes. So we're going to go and test it out on the roads but also on the track. At first glance, the redesigned Audi RS3 looks much sharper and more assertive than its predecessor, with styling inspired by the latest RS6 Avant and RS7 Sportback. The body sits 25mm closer to the ground than that of the A3, while the front track is 33mm wider. The huge single-frame grille featuring a rhombus design and black contour that flows into the redesigned headlights, black rocker extensions and a set of 19-inch five-spoke RS alloy wheels help define its sporty character. In Europe and other markets, the RS3 is available in a five-door sportback configuration in addition to the four-door sedan, but unfortunately we will only get the sedan here in North America. Inside, the new RS3 looks and feels way more refined and upscale. We particularly like the carbon fiber dashboard, the Nappa leather seats with a honeycomb pattern middle section, and either gloss black, red, or green stitching, as well as the three-spoke flat bottom steering wheel that gets a top center marker with the optional design package. Audi's virtual cockpit is included, though with RS-specific graphics and colors. For instance, the tachometer goes from green to yellow to red to indicate when it's time to switch gears using the paddle shifters. The 2022 Audi RS3, which lands in Canada in the second quarter of next year, is also the new lap record holder for the compact class on the northern loop of the Nürburgring racetrack in Germany, as Audi test driver and racer Frank Stippler set a lap time of 7 minutes, 40 seconds and 748 thousandths of a second. Here's Frank Stippler at work at the wheel of the new RS3. Turbocharged 2.5 liter five cylinder engine still produces 394 horsepower, but peak torque is increased to 369 pounds feet, which can access across a wider rev range. As always, it's a thrill to listen to the unique sound of this five cylinder engine. The key highlight of the 2022 Audi RS3 is most definitely the new rear axle torque splitter which consists of two multi-plate clutches that handle torque vectoring from one side to the other. In torque rear mode, the system makes drifting super easy by sending up to 1,290 pounds-feet of torque to the rear outside wheel only. As you can well imagine, Audi was keen to let me try this drift mode on a specially arranged drift pad at the wheel of an RS3 Sportback. All right. Well, that was quite the amusement park ride, 
except you're in control. And this car is just a gem. To be able to do it like that, just amazing. We continued our test drive of the new Audi RS3 with a lapping session at the Megara circuit near Athens. This time, we set the torque splitter in performance mode, which distributes torque in a way that makes the car feel balanced in corners, with zero understeer or oversteer. Audi Canada has not yet announced pricing for the 2022 RS3, but it will likely be around $65,000 like the outgoing model. So in the end, the Audi engineers have done a superb job with the Audi RS3 by taking it to another level in terms of handling, in terms of dynamics. Obviously, this new torque splitter at the rear, which allows you to shift the power from one side to the other and that really makes the RS3 a really incredible performance machine.